Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. I'm Amanda and this is going to be another day in the life as a stay-at-home mom and we'll call this episode three. Um, first off, if you hear any crunching in the background, my kitty cats are eating their food. So if you hear that, that's what that noise is. But we are just starting off in the kitchen. Now we had my oldest ended up having a stomach bug. Um, and so he stayed home for a few days and just dealing with that, trying to get the house disinfected and all the things of running on no sleep. Um, I didn't get a video done, so I ended up recording this on Friday, but I was limited time because we were actually going on a dinner train ride, which was so fun. Um, that was definitely something that was kind of like on my bucket list was to do something like that. Um, and we definitely enjoyed it and we, we want to go back because they do like murder mystery ones and they do like a polar express for like the kids and stuff. And then they have like a princess tea party thing, but obviously I have boys, so we wouldn't do that. But my oldest wants to go on a train ride. So we thought it'd be awesome to take him for the Polar Express. So we'll probably do that. Um, obviously when it gets closer to Christmas time, so that'll be super fun. I'm super excited about that. Um, but because I'm on like a time limit today, I'm just focusing on the main areas. Uh, my mother-in-law was coming over to watch the boys. Um, so I just wanted to get like the main areas cleaned up and we are obviously starting off in the kitchen by doing some dishes. And um, then I got some dishes in the dishwasher that need to be put away. And of course, my uh, sink is full of dirty dishes as well. Now that the dishes are all done, I'm just going to kind of move around into the kitchen and start cleaning off the countertops.
understand half the stuff you're saying. We took a hit, and I don't know if we were saving. You don't see what I see, try and make up with apologies, yeah. It's hard to tell the truth, but I just don't know if I'm even still in love with you. Now I'm just going to grab my Tenco over here and get it ready and I'm actually going to start cleaning the floors with it and to be honest with you this was kind of pointless because it ended up raining later that night and was pouring early this morning so and it, I feel like it doesn't matter how much we try and clean the dog's paws off when they come in there's still some type of mud trekked in their little pee paws and so it's like pointless to ever clean the floors when it rains or like the day before or anything like that but i was glad i got it done because it definitely needed to be done it just doesn't work for me i want to play with fire let me get hurt And a Playboy Mac. Many used to have to work for that. 
Wait for me, gotta dial up. Can't call my landline, cause it's all tied up. Just bike over there. Oh! So now you're going to see how nasty the floor was and like look at all that hair I picked up. So gross. Um, honestly, if I had more time, I would have redid the floor again just because of how nasty the water was. Um, but obviously I didn't have time with my time limit that I was trying to make here. But um, again, I'm glad that I finally got that done. Conversation. And my life feels so vacant Without you I'm just moving in between A sad reality No, I'm patient But I've been out here waiting For someone else to fill the void in my Now I'm just going to put it back on the dock here And then clean off the rollers a little bit And then do like a, an automatic self-clean on the Tenko Holding on to what you left was it all in my head when you said you love me? Cause no one can love me better than you did. And I'm still not over it. Did you forget? I put you before me. Memories haunted me knowing you gave it up instead. You did. Was it all just in my head? I'm worried that it all meant nothing. I'm worried that you don't miss me too. I'm worried that I'll never find someone to replace you And I've heard you're with someone else But I'm here by myself, holding on to what you left So now that the kitchen is all clean, I'm just going to put one of these wax melts in my warmer here And this is like one of my favorite scents There is another one as well I can't think of it off the top of my head But the fall ones are really what I love um, and I have been gravitating towards um, some of the flowery ones as well. But I just don't feel like they last as long. Um, but I definitely love fall scents. And uh, now I'm just moving on into the living room and starting to pick up all of the toys that are all over the place, of course. Um, but I don't know if you've seen the little sourdough starter kit that was next to the wax warmer. So Tyler ended up getting me that for my birthday, which I was so excited about because I've been wanting to make sourdough and obviously he knows that. So he ended up getting me that stuff and I'm very excited to try it. I haven't done it yet. I just haven't had the time and I wanted to get it done in this video, but of course didn't have the time, but hopefully the next video I will show you guys how how that kit works and what you do and all of the things. I'm very new with the starter dough, um, with sourdough. So, um, I'm extremely excited to try it. I did make homemade bread last week, which was so yummy. And that was so exciting. Um, I definitely want to try it again and I would like to try and make wheat bread. Um, so we will see how that goes. But now we are in the bathroom and I'm just going to start getting all this cleaned up. Um, I will mention that I did end up cleaning the toilet like the day before with my son having a stomach bug. It needed to be cleaned. Um, so I'm not going to necessarily clean the inside of the bowl in this video, but I am going to clean and disinfect everything else around in the bathroom. So you through a window, you won't wish somebody so I sent a message, asked you how life has been, I am braver through the phone, it's been a long time, since you were all mine, in the wilderness, that's where I've been, after a long night, and some red wine, could you see me like that?
You showed up, I felt underdressed. There's just something about your body. It's so classical and timeless. Makes me forget where I am. It's been a long time since you were all mine. Now I'm going to go back to the living room area and I get my sweeper out and start sweeping off the rug here. And then I'm going to take the Tinco and start cleaning off the hardwood floors. Got a good way of healing. I'm back on my feet and I'm happier than ever. Like I never thought forever was you. Pieces of a dream, every little thing I thought we'd be learning how to let go of all the ways you burn me, and I was hurt. Those boys are like seriously so funny and actually later in the video, well, later in the day, not the video, we ended up having like a little dance party. My oldest kept saying, let's do our own thing. And he, he's like, we're having so much fun. And he's so silly. Like he loves to have like little parties and like it was so funny because one, one day, just like randomly, 
Tyler came home from work and my oldest wanted to set up like a little surprise party for him. So he has like this dinosaur thing that you throw balls at. He set that up and he wanted to do balloons, but I did not have the energy to blow up any balloons. Um, but he set some things up, uh, some games out and he took a box and put some of his toys in it as a gift for him. Like he's just so funny. He's so thoughtful. He has just a heart of gold. He is the best little boy ever. Um, both my boys are just, oh gosh, they're so sweet. They're both so different though in personalities. Um, you see my youngest, his personality, he's so rotten. I'm definitely gonna have my hands full with that one. Um, but now I'm just finishing off cleaning the floor and, um, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Got some motivation out of it. Um, I will mention also that this little stinker, he was messing with the Tinko and now it speaks a whole nother language. So I don't know what it's saying, but <laughs> I'll have to get that figured out. But here's the nasty water. So gross, but Yep, that's going to be it for today's video, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to give this a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe down below if you are not already.